And today is February the 6th, 2020. It is Throwback Thursday. Now, girl, put your hand on your heart. Now, off to the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back, JSA. Make sure you should tucked in. Make sure you wear your black or brown belt. And always have your ID badges on. Elementary, please make sure you go to the right specials today. And it's Black History Month. Black and white shit unite. Now, off to the entertainment. Hey JSA, we're continuing our Black History Month trivia. Yesterday's answer was Chuck Berry. Here's a late video about him. <clears throat> Chuck Berry was an American black man who was famous for the songs he wrote and sung. He was born on October 18, 1926 in a town where many middle class people lived. He suffered a cardiac arrest on March 18, 2017, then later died. Chuck Berry was exposed to music the majority of his life. When he was a teen he was arrested for armed robbery and was sent to prison for three years. After that he began to start making his own music and publishing it in the 1950s. His influential lyrics and incredible guitar playing allowed him to be known as the King of Rock and get number one hit in 1972 with the song My Ding -a Ling. He also inspired many people with his creative way he plays the electric guitar. Today's Black History Month question is, This man was a Baptist minister and was arrested several times for speaking out against racism. During one of his prison stays, he wrote a letter from a Birmingham jail. Be sure to tell Mr. Sears your response, and if you are correct, you can get some Jag bucks. Thanks for watching, JSA. Remember your three Vs. Be respectful, be responsible, and be engaged. JSA TV signing out.